Hi everybody, I'm back with the last video for this Friday. Thank you for being with me and hanging in there. This one is a little chunky monkey and it measures eight and a quarter by five. And I've got some really pretty doilies back here. Um, this is part of a crochet doily here. And um, I took a real pretty image of a lady and I stitched around her in gold over and over and over again to kind of frame it. And then it's got some stitching running down here with the brown flowers. I thought it went really well. And there's the back and the spine. And I used a soft mint green for the closure. And on the inside, I've got uh, the mint green here with a piece of lace. And I kept it simple because there's a lot going on in here. I got one of these heavy duty cards with the fabrics and the lined paper on the back. Y'all don't need these strings. And a little um, journaling book. And it's got uh, a pocket in the front with some script stamping and some little mini goodies in here. Some little mini tags and a teapot. And got a little bit of stenciling on the coffee dyed papers with a little Paris uh, Eiffel Tower there. And then a pocket in the back with two more tags. And another little teapot card. Isn't that cute? Doop -doop. And these real pretty ladies. And I stitched in a, it's a, a pinky brown color. Which I thought complemented it really nicely. Lined paper here. This is stuff from the other side. I used the matching flowers from the front cover and put in, and that's part of a, a doily there with the roses. Nice big card that's all grunged up. And a little letter thing. Letter thing. Stitching going down the edge there. Really pretty image to write on with lace coming over. So pretty. I tried to leave some places for journal, and you know it kills me. Look pretty. Uh, look at that dress, just stunning in the chair and the table, just beautiful. With some seam binding and a rose. A little tuck spot here with a little card that is stitched around, and it's got a bow and some fabrics, and this has got. Some fabrics with a little butterfly. Get in there. Get in there. And part of a book page, and it's got some washi tape to make it a little bit uh, more secure because this is an old book. And I didn't want it coming apart, so I reinforced it. Another lace pocket here with part, uh, parts of doilies and a rose. And on the inside, look at that. Yummy. And of course the stitching from the other side. More stitching here. I love her. I think she's gorgeous. Some fabric from the other side here. I use different fabrics and laces. Little butterfly. He doesn't do anything. He just sits there and looks pretty. <laughs> Some lace there. Pretty images. Plenty of places to write. Look, I used a, a part of a crochet doily for the edge. And I love how that came out. That's just pretty. Stitching here. And lace. In the book page. Lots of uneven pages. Little pocket here that's been embossed. And then I inked over it and grunged it up. And then put some lace and part of a doily and little fabric bits. Just love that. I love these kind of cards. They're great for making notes or lists. If you're a list person. I'm a list person. Stitching there. 
Look, isn't she beautiful? And look, look at what's in her hair. Oh, they dressed so gorgeous back then. A little belly band here with a, um, just a real pretty bow hanging down, part of a crochet doily. And some laces and fuzzies. Some more fabric peeping out over the edges. Seam binding, lace. Another pocket here, and it's got laces and part of it, parts of a doily with a pretty image. And then this is a fabric card. I just stitched the fabric on top, and it's got an image behind it, but it's real faint. It just kind of barely peeps through. Nice sturdy card. Yeah, there you go. And some different stitching. Part of that book page. Nice uh, stitching going around. And the lace. They're just beautiful images. Part of a crochet doily there. I'm really liking that. More lace and goodies. Pretty butterfly. Some fabric there. Little pretty flowers. Another pocket with um, a rose and part of a crochet doily. And a postcard with a rose on the back. See, rose and a rose. part of that book page and a little tuck spot here with some laces and part of a crochet doily I like how it um, sticks up over the top of the page I think that's neato and you can still you still can write over here a pretty image with the flower and the laces yeah, this is a yummy book. I just love these ladies. I love their dress. I bet you it took them four or five hours just to get ready. Lord have mercy. Give me my flip-flops. Let me put my hair back in a ponytail. I'm good to go. <laughs> How we've changed. So I'm uh, part of a crochet doily, and I just uh, let the coffee dyed uh, pocket peep through. It's got some flowers, some little daisies, and... Then inside, I put a little booklet. It's got some ephemera and just different pages to write on. In the back, my wacky sewing machine. And then one of these hard, uh, no, this isn't a hard card. This is a big fold out. I got confused, as we say in the sound. Some cheesecloth and a little bow there. Mm -hmm. I'll get down there. And another card there with the teal. Thought it matched well. And there's the back. And all that just peeps over. Just comes on over and I love that. And there's the front again. And this is the last video for this Friday. And I'm glad y'all were here. And I will see y'all in the next videos. Bye-bye.